Welcome to Tech Eureka TV, where we explore the exciting world of science and technology. Today, we're talking about holographic display technology. Holographic display technology has been a fascinating topic in the field of science and technology for decades. The idea of projecting three-dimensional images in mid-air has always been the stuff of science fiction. But with advancements in technology, it's now becoming a reality. This technology has the potential to change the way we interact with digital information, making it more immersive and intuitive. It all started in 1947, when the first hologram was created by Hungarian physicist Denis Gabor. Gabor was working on improving electron microscopes. But he stumbled upon the concept of holography while trying to eliminate the glare that was interfering with his images. Holography is the science of producing holograms, which are 3D images created by the interference of light beams. In the case of holographic displays, the technology works by projecting light through a holographic medium to create an illusion of a 3D object floating in mid-air. The light is manipulated in such a way that it appears to be coming from the object itself, creating the illusion of depth. There are several different approaches to creating holographic displays, including holographic projection, volumetric displays, and integral imaging. Holographic projection involves projecting light through a holographic medium to create the illusion of a 3D image. Volumetric displays work by using light to create a 3D image in a box. While integral imaging uses multiple cameras to capture a scene and display it as a hologram. One of the most significant advantages of holographic displays is that they can create images that appear to be three-dimensional, even though they are actually flat. This makes them ideal for a variety of applications, such as medical imaging, product design, and entertainment. In medical imaging, holographic displays can be used to create 3D images of the human body allowing doctors to better understand the anatomy and to make more accurate diagnoses. In product design, holographic displays can be used to create prototypes of new products, allowing designers to see how they will look in the real world. And in entertainment, holographic displays can be used to create immersive experiences, such as virtual concerts or gaming. However, there are still several challenges that need to be overcome before holographic displays can become widespread. One of the biggest challenges is creating displays that are large enough to be useful, while still being affordable. Another challenge is creating displays that are bright enough to be used in well-lit environments. Finally, there is the challenge of creating displays that are capable of displaying a full-color image, rather than just monochrome images. Despite these challenges, the potential benefits of holographic displays are enormous. They have the potential to revolutionize the way we interact with digital information, making it more immersive and intuitive. Whether it's for medical imaging, product design, or entertainment, the possibilities for this technology are virtually limitless. And with continued advancements in technology, it's likely that we'll see holographic displays become more and more common in the years to come. So, if you're a fan of science and technology, keep an eye on holographic display technology. This exciting field has the potential to change the way we interact with digital information and bring us one step closer to a future of truly immersive, 3D experiences. So there you have it, a brief overview of the world of holographic imaging. If you found this video informative and fascinating, don't forget to subscribe for more exciting and informative content about science and technology. Let us know in the comments below what other topics you would like us to cover in the future. We are always looking for new ideas and topics to explore.